Check out BigBadToyStore.com for Combined Wars figures and more. Please check out the link down in the description below. It helps me out a lot. My hair is sticking up. Hello guys, what's up? I'm Brian here doing a new video for you guys. And this time I am posting my predictions of what Bruticus, Combiner Wars Bruticus, will be like. Now with that being said, no official photos have been posted as of the time of this recording. And I keep up with the news quite often. So anyone posting like, hey, uh, Bruticus has been officially posted, or you idiot, this happened and that happened, why don't you know this? This has been recorded before anything got posted. Thank you. Anyways, what I'm saying is don't correct me on anything once official photos have been posted because I'll know about it. Thank you. Anyways, with that being said, let's move on to the predictions. Now with that being said, there's a couple of obvious ones, and that being Vortex will be a remold of Alpha Bravo. Who didn't see that one coming? You didn't! You didn't! You didn't! You all did! It's pretty obvious. Anyways, with that being said, uh, I'll just move on from that. Swindle will probably most likely be a remold of Off-Road. But more or less a remold of first aid because of the back section I just feel like that's more fitting for a swindle. Now with that being said it could still be remolded from that and the back section could look a little different. I can see where they can go with that. As well the front section I want to see more like a jeep quite honestly. Anyways with that being said let's move on from that. Now with Brawl and Blastoff, they could be just re- or not remolds, they could just be new molds. But if they are going to be remolds, I'm going to guess that Brawl is going to be a remold of Rook. Now, I know that Rook's more like an armored truck, but he's the closest thing to a tank than anyone else. So, with that being said, I think that he's going to be the Brawl of the set. Or be remolded into Brawl for the set, I should say. Anyways, uh, with that being said, you, uh, what's going to happen most likely is he's either going to have a new piece that plugs on the top that will actually be the turret. Because you do have that peg section. Or you'll use the hand or feet, whatever you want to call it, combiner piece and just plug it on the top. Which I think will be a little cheap, but that's probably what they're going to do. Uh, I, I think it's going to be something that actually gets removed because I don't see that turret section uh, being placed on there and looking good for like a knee piece for Bruticus. I could be wrong, but I think that's going to be a little too bulky for the set. Again, I could be wrong, so we'll just have to wait and see. Now, with that being said, Blastoff is one that is a little hard to predict. But I'm going to say that he's going to be a heavy remold of Fireflight. And the reason why I say this is he could be a remold of Alpha Bravo. I can see that happening. But quite honestly, I don't feel like they'll use the same mold again. At least not for the uh at least not for the Bruticus set. Now with that being said, uh, Fireflight has more of a Decepticon look than anyone else personally uh, that's how, that's what I feel uh, compared to who is it skydive and uh, air raid and whoever else he just has more of a Decepticon shape than anyone else especially with the shoulders uh, so again I think he's going to be a very heavy remold of Fireflight or Firefly whatever you want to call him Anyways, with that being said, let's move on to the main combiner piece of Onslaught. And obviously, this is probably going to be a room mold of Hotspot, if anything. Alright? Uh, now, it could get a whole new mold. I could be wrong about that, but that's what I personally think. Now, it will be interesting to see what they'll do with the ladder, even if they don't change it. But I think he's going to have new guns that will form the turret section. Uh, I could be wrong about anything. I could be wrong about this whole thing, but that's my personal prediction. Now, with that being said, the Legends class toy that I think that will be involved with the set is Viper. That's it. Just Viper. 
Now you're probably thinking, oh, why don't they use a, a, gro a groove repaint for the chest piece? They could do that, or they can also use a tank turret for Brawl that actually transforms into a chest piece, maybe? I don't know. Maybe that could happen. I doubt it, but that's just something to kind of throw in at you if you think about. Anyways, with that being said, those are my predictions about the whole set of Bruticus as a whole. Uh, I know that I predict a lot of remolds, but I'm just thinking out loud. This video is just about me thinking out loud of what Bruticus could be. I could be wrong about anything. In fact, I don't think that tank turret thing forming the chest piece will actually work out. But it could, maybe? I don't know. Anyways, with that being said, uh, again, those are my personal predictions. Actually, now that I think of it, I think that the tank turret will form the main gun for Bruticus or the back turrets for Bruticus. Um, that might be interesting. And then the two guns that Onslaught would include could combine to form the main gun or just connect to the back or something like that. I don't know. But I, again, I'm just thinking out loud. Anyways, with that being said, those are my predictions. Please share your predictions down below in the comment section. Don't forget to like, comment, share, subscribe, and all this fun do that. I'll see you guys next time. Peace.